Welcome to Awesome Code. Please subscribe to my channel and like my video. In this video, we are going to learn how to use get pass in Python. So first, we are going to uh, import get pass module from get pass library. We are going to type from get pass import get pass and I'm going to define uh, a function so we are going to create our uh, get username password function this would be f get username password This function will prompt for and returns a username and password. So we are going to prompt user for user ID. So this would be our username. And we are going to type in input. Please enter user name. And we are going to set original password to none. So we are going to keep prompting till password is entered. So we are going to use while not password. And we are going to get the, the password by using get pass and saving a password variable. So the password. And we use get pass. Please enter password. Now we are going to confirm the password. So this will be password confirm. Okay. To call get pass again. Confirm password. And now we are going to uh, verify the password. We are going to check with the password. And if the password failed to verify, we are going to print the message that passwords do not match. So we are going to compare we are going to use if password not equals password confirm we 
are going to print a message. Password. Do not match. And now we are going to reset password to net. Password set to none. And ask for the password again. At the end, we are just going to print the username and password. Print. And then we are going to return username and password. We can call get username password function. Now we are going to run our code. So I'm going to and username and now we are going to add the password and for the confirm password i'm just going to add a wrong password it says password do not match so it prompts for password again I'm going to add some password and the valid password again. So we get the username and the password. So the car password was confirmed. So now we are going to run the program again. First, I'm going to clear the screen. And this time I went to a username and just an empty password. I'm going to just hit enter and enter again. And it will keep prompting me for the password. So password and the correct password for the confirm. Keep on learning, please subscribe to my channel on the same code, like my video, keep supporting me, and thank you for watching.